Hey guys, so today is Tuesday morning, 7.09 in the morning, and I'm starting a new thing on my channel, and I don't know if this is going to last, because I don't know if this is something that you guys want to see, but I'm considering starting vlogging. So, a lot of the channels that I watch and that I really enjoy and that truly entertain me on YouTube are vlogging channels, and so... I want to hear your guys' input, whether it's good or bad. If you just want me to stick with recipe videos and, you know, the sit-down videos where I ramble on about raw veganism and detoxification, then that's fine. I won't be offended and I will continue doing that. But if any of you guys are interested in kind of the daily life of Victoria, then I will do that. And I will warn you that my life is not uh, entertaining at all. But... You know, I'm willing to do that. So we're going to start this out. It's going to be a little experiment. I'm um, getting ready to go to work. So I have to, of course, get my food ready or really just liquids for the morning. So what I do is I'm in my freezer and I'm getting some ice packs. So every day when I go to work, I have a little... Um, what's it called? Like, I don't know. little cooler thing that I got from Whole Foods. Okay, my camera didn't have enough memory, so I had to delete some stuff. But anyway, down here I have a couple coconut waters and an alkaline water in glass bottles and some little freezy blocks, and that's what I take to work every morning, and it works very well for me. So let me... Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go to work, so I gotta shut everything down in my room. I have the video uploading See, it failed. I have the 40 minute video of my uh, recent raw food class and it won't upload. So I don't know what it is, but it's very annoying. Okay, so I have this thing where I like making my bed before I go to work. So you're gonna do that? I know this. I'm gonna show you making my bed. I'm telling you these vlogs are not going to be that entertaining. Four, three, two, uno. Listen up, y'all, cause this is it. The beat that I'm banging is delicious. Burgalicious definition, make them boys go loco. They want my treasures so they get their pleasure. Okay, so now I've got to put my tennis shoes on, my jacket, but ready to go to work. Aren't those door beads ridiculous? I know. I went on a door beads kick. You can't see my face, but I promise you I'm there. So just putting my tennis shoes on. It's going to be a good day today. It's going to be a busy day. I uh, have a lot to do. So my new thing in the... In the life is hey how you can't see my face my new thing lately is going to the gym and getting on the treadmill so whenever I feel like I was my leanest because I'm definitely not my leanest right now and I'm trying to fix that to be honest but um, I was going on the treadmill a lot and back in college and I have well, yesterday was day one of doing that. So I just went to the gym and like jogged and then walked on the treadmill for like 30 minutes and really enjoy it. So just going to start doing that. I just, I really love movement. And so yeah, I got to put my jacket on. Okay. So anyway, I'm about to leave to go to work, but periodically throughout the day, I'm going to try to film. And if you guys think that this type of video for my channel is ridiculous, please tell me because... I am, I don't know if I can do it, it's so weird to me, but I like watching vlogs, so, and even mukbangs, I'm considering doing raw vegan mukbangs, tell me, would you guys like that? That would be, be very funny. Okay, but anyway, I'm taking my stuff and I'm headed out to work. You know what, I never lose my keys, because there's a giant puffball on them.
This is my routine every morning. Put my bags in the car. I've really got to get used to vlogging. So I'm in my car. Put the music on. Um, I need to maybe get like a car mount or something. I know that a lot of people do that. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go to work right now. There's nowhere I can really put you guys in my car to get used to this. Does that work? I mean, you see the steering wheel, but let me turn the music off to avoid copyright issues. Well, because I have like a screen that pops up in my car, and so I'm thinking that maybe I could set you guys on that. But anyway, so yeah, I'm driving to work right now. Believe me, I got both my hands, so this is safe. Um, yeah, so whenever, let's talk about the weight thing. So whenever I was in college, I was super stressed out with school. Oh my God, it is cold in here. Thank God for seat warmers, that's all I gotta say. Um, I was super stressed out with school. I was just beginning my detoxification journey, which I really think made me shed a lot of weight too. Um, I think the skinniest I've ever been in my life is like 122 pounds. We're getting real real on here. And I'm saying that because I don't care. Like That's why I'm vlogging or whatever. I just, I'm kind of an open book in a lot of ways. In a lot of ways I am private, but I like showing my life and being like, I want you guys to know that you guys aren't alone, you know, whether you're trying to lose weight as a raw vegan or whatever. So, um, now I don't weigh. So honestly, I don't know how much I weigh. I could be 135, which is, I think where I'm at. Um, or I could be 145. I don't know. I'm kind of scared to weigh honestly, but I just know like how I fit in clothes and everything like that. Um, that I am, you know, I've gained weight. And so I am trying to not only tailor my diet, which I think is already very healthy, but you know, maybe less calories, whatever. I know that a lot of vegans are like, you can never eat too many calories, blah, blah, blah. I'm serious. That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. You can, you know, eat too much food to where you are literally engorged and then you gain weight. I mean, it just makes sense. So I'm trying to like scale back on that a little bit. Obviously still eating raw vegan, super healthy, but um, also I am incorporating more cardio into my life. So for the last two years of my life, I've been doing Pilates and I love it and I need it a lot. I have a lot of postural issues. I have an anterior tilt for you guys that know that. I have hypermobile joints, hypermobile body really. So I need Pilates and I need that strength and I'm going to continue to do that obviously, but I just, I'm incorporating more cardio. And I remember when I was at my skinniest in college, I was on the treadmill a lot. That weird noise is my windshield wiper, but. Um, so I'm doing jazzercise, which is a lot of cardio, and the treadmill, um, maybe not eating as much. And although that's hard for me because I love to eat. And it shows, you know? <laughs> so even if you're eating healthy raw foods, you can still eat too much. And you know, gain weight. So anyway, this is kind of my journey and I'm not ashamed to say it. You know, we all are self-conscious about our weight in some way or another. Um, and I don't care what anyone says, you know, no one's perfect. I have never claimed to be perfect. I know about healthy eating and detoxification. Um, and I incorporate that into my life, but does that mean that I am up in the angels singing with the butterflies and fairies? No. I mean, I live a day-to-day -day life too. I have stress too, and I'm starting to document that. So, whatever. That's just my little jib. I'm going to drive to work now, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs> hey guys. So, I had a very, very busy day, and I didn't get to vlog a lot, but I'm literally sitting down on top of my bed right now for dinner, and this is my salad. So, this is um, a bunch of green leaf lettuce and chopped up celery. Then the dressing is tomatoes, tahini, cayenne, a dash of apple cider vinegar, and some all-purpose salt-free seasoning. Um, and that is it. So this is really good. I'm getting ready to chow down. Okay, you guys. So I just ate my salad a little bit ago, and I wanted something else, but nothing heavy, nothing, you know, heavy, basically. 
So I put one of these Harmless Harvest Coconut Waters in a cup. And then, my fridge, I want to show you, I put a scoop of this raw organic meal. Um, it just tastes like vanilla. It's loaded with probiotics and a lot of good stuff. So just did that as a little pick-me-up. Oh, also throughout the day, all I had was two cartons of raspberries. And they're so good.